Parabens and phthalates are endocrine disruptors and cause cancer. Is this true? Not exactly. I'm a cancer researcher with a PhD in biochemistry, and I've read papers, not just the headlines. And here's the tip. Back in 2004, a small study detected parabens in breast tumor tissues, and that alone kicked off the whole paraben equals cancer panic. But guess what? Those early studies never showed causation. They just found the presence of paraben. That's like finding blood at a crime scene and saying, aha, the blood caused the crime. In fact, parabens and phthalate metabolites are also found in healthy tissues since they're widely used in personal care products. So major health agencies like the FDA and the American Cancer Society have reviewed the data and agreed there is no solid link between parabens in cosmetic and cancer. So if you dig a little deeper, you will find that there are my studies showing a slight increase in the breast cancer risk linked to disrupted estrogen signaling, while others suggest that parabens may actually lower the risk of breast cancer by acting through androgen receptor. Not all studies are conducted with the same level of rigor, so it's important to look at the data and interpret the findings carefully. Okay, So I wouldn't say parabens and phthalates are cancer-causing, but I just call them unnecessary chemicals and I don't put them in my products.